Hi, I'm Ben at LearningSurfPhotography.com. I'm going to do a really quick unboxing now of um, a mouth mount for your GoPro. Uh, it's from Pro Standard. So the website address is ProStandard.com. It's called the Grill Mount. Um, and yeah, I mean, there's a few different ways you can use it. I'll just show you exactly what comes in the box. It's not quite nice packaging that you get with it. Also got a couple here, so I'll explain what I'm going to do with those in a minute. Um, so you've got a few different ways uh, like that you can use them out here. Um, I'll put a link in the um, description there to a video uh, of a couple of people use how they use theirs. There's some cool product photos of a guy actually using it in the water, which is good to see. Um, a little blurb on the back. Pro standard. Okay, so opening it up, we've got a little bolt. Uh, so that's going to be where your GoPro bolt goes in. It's nice that they put that in a packet so it doesn't get lost. Uh, cool, it fits in there. So just as like any other GoPro mount would. Got nice soft kind of rubberized grips and the actual thing itself is, is like a white plastic. Feels really sturdy, like it's, it weighs next to nothing but it's not gonna snap. It doesn't feel in any way like it's, um, brittle uh, like some GoPro kind of plastic mounts can do. This is this feels great, it's kind of hollowed out on the back as well, so I guess that keeps the, the weight down a little bit. Um, the idea, um, according to the packages and the videos I've watched, is you can use it not only for a, a like a traditional mouth mount. Um, this is the Hero 4 Silver, so naturally that slots on no problem there. Um, I'll probably end up using a floaty back door as well. It's pretty good. Um, and the GoPro Hero, like the, the budget option, naturally is going to fit on perfectly as well. No worries. Um, don't get like a leash with it or anything like that. Um, and I have read a little bit on their site and they, they kind of don't really recommend a leash. The guys in the photos aren't using it or anything like that. Um, I think you could use one quite easily. You could just thread it through there uh, if, you, if you wanted to use one. Um, I might try it out because I think I'd because of the way it works and, and how flexible and um, I guess versatile it could be, um, I might want to try and hold it in my mouth, take it out while I'm in a barrel, hopefully, <laughs> uh, move it around, things like that, <laughs> as if I'm going to get a barrel that long. Um, but yeah, I, I think um, I might end up putting a leash on there, but I'll see. You get a little sticker, Pro Standard, and you get a little bit of information here. So this is good, it tells you how to mold these, um, what do they call it, bite tabs, mold, mold the bite tabs to fit your teeth and you can remold it again, it's got some good diagrams there. You just pop it in some boiling water for, so look, 45 seconds, um, bite down for 30 seconds, I guess you're going to wait till that cools down, oh yeah let it cool a bit, top tip, bite down. Right, so then you can always repeat those steps as well to redo it afterwards, but I guess that's going to give you like a gum shield, custom fit, gripping um, grip in your teeth when you use it. So um, there's always this little groove down the top, so this kind of wishbone looking bit has a groove down it, so I read that that is, that's your air channel, right. So, yeah, I think I should... They do say to, um, to test it out and, and to make sure you test it with the back door if you're using one. So to get your grip right before you pop it in the boiling water for a few minutes, for a few seconds. But yeah, I mean, it definitely feels like I can breathe and I can seal it if I don't want to have any water getting in. So that might be a little bit of an advantage over some of the other designs I've used where it's very hard to seal it. So you have to kind of blow out of the, the mount whilst you're underwater if you don't want to swallow anything. <laughs> So that's the Pro Standard grill mount. I'm looking forward to trying it out. Um, I'm gonna have a little video up here of me boiling it and, and taking it out and I'll, um, I'll show you what that process was. But nice packaging, keeping it simple. Good instructions, all well written English and things. You get a little bolt with it, which is a bonus. Um, I think it's gonna be, it's, there's no flex in it at all. So it means 
you're not going to get that kind of wobble that you might get on more rubberized mounts, I think. But we'll wait and see. I'm going to be following this up with a kind of um, review video of a few different options for mouth mounts and alternatives. I've got a helmet cam setter that I can use as well. So I'll, um, I'll follow that up. Um, so subscribe for that one. Check out my other videos for uh, pistol grip reviews um, for the GoPro as well. So if you're into surfing, that might be useful. I'm really looking forward to trying this one out. I think it's going to be interesting and hopefully I'll get some waves very soon, like this in the coming week, and there'll be a video along shortly with two or three different options for you to consider um, and my recommendations. Thanks very much.